Let's get to work. Oh, come on! He's quick, huh? Proves you were Jedi. No. Facing you. Memories that have haunted me since Braca. I won't run from them anymore. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. Show me what you are truly capable of. <laughs> What is power the answer? You chose to return. Brave. But not wise. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm Cal Kestis. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say, Cal. Malikos said many things too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire, I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. 
an armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us and cut down my people, my sisters, until I was left alone with the dead. Then Malikos came and promised me revenge if I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. Malikos lies ahead. You could turn back. I can't. Lives are at stake. Whose lives? Innocents. Four sensitive children who will be hunted down and murdered. As we were. My friend, I have never been one to shy away from the pursuit of knowledge. Alcestis! Malikos. Welcome home. You need to begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much to risk death? I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding. Power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the Order. Restore the Jedi Order. Oh, you poor fool. It's over! Jedi fell long before the Purge. We were stifled by tradition. Deafened by our past glories. Blinded by endless war. Maybe. But it's never over, Malikos. We stand here now, the chance to learn. To rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. And Dathomir will be your grave. <laughs> The only coward runs. <laughs> Not 
my crew will perish. Now, let's finish this. You will not beat me. Let him lie in the dark with his secrets until death takes him. Why'd you help me? To rid Dothamir of that parasite. What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium. It opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it, too. What Empire? The Empire. The one bent on exterminating four sensitives so no one can stand against it? Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. Thank you for helping me with Malikos. I thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. Right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah, I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. Don't waste time. This place, it's... Horrifying. Finally found it. Yeah. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you. And your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. After the purge, I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding, I was, I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listen? Well, no. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors 
for your dad. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. What do you think, BD? I agree. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. There's no way forward. There is now. Did you raise the ones before, too? I did. I wanted to see how you would handle molecules. You were testing me? Time to pass. Congratulations. Are you gonna help me with this? I'm sure you can handle it. Something terrible happened here. Uh, a massacre. They killed their own kind for promises of power. This woman you travel with, who is she? See her? Wait, how do you know about her? I have seen your companions. Malikos wanted me to attack them, but they posed no threat. See her, um... Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I'll meet you at your ship. I think this is your strength. Hey, BD, take a little Have fun in there?
You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. And we trust you. You will have to earn it. Okay, fine. Grab some seat. Don't even try anything funny. Welcome aboard. They like you. I don't know what you're saying. Later, Cal. Please. Okay, let's pick our next destination. This Cordova guy is really putting some wear and tear on my ship. He always wanted to explore the whole galaxy. And did you? We explored many planets. Tombs and temples related to the Zepho and Jedi. But I hit a limit. To him, there was no limit. The poor crazy old guy was left alone. He was always alone, even when I was with him. He cared about his work and the future more than anything else. He didn't have the time. He was always on the move. Magana was the first place I ever saw that looked like he settled, even for a brief moment. Time to land. Get up here. You think it'll work? It worked for Cordova. You can make it work. She's right. Oh, hey, is anybody hungry? I, I was thinking of whipping up some scar steaks. I'm sorry, am I interrupting? No, Captain. And we couldn't have gotten this far without you. Oh, <laughs> well, uh, it's true, Grease. Thank you. Hey, I hope you get in there and you find that hollow thing. Holocron. Are you sure it's something you should find? What do you mean? The children on that list. If you take them from their homes to train as Jedi, won't they be hunted like you? be kept out of the hands of the Empire. It'll help us put an end to the Empire. Oh, hey, uh, change of plans, we're arriving. Oh, Grease. <laughs> yeah? I take my steak rare. Huh. <laughs> huh? Okay, now we're cooking. Wait up. I know you're about to get that hollow cron. Nice. You remembered. You joining me? Oh, no, no, absolutely not. No, I just wanted to say, you know, those, those kids we're supposed to find. They're lucky to have you. They're lucky to have us. We're in this together, Grease. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't hoping you'd say that, because, you know, they're going to need more than fancy magic tricks. Oh, uh, yeah? Practical guidance, role model, someone to look up to. You know, ship flying's a complicated art. But that's only if I stick around. I remember that. Good. Good. Okay. Good luck, buddy. You and Marin getting along? Oh, yeah. I mean, she still freaks me out, you know, the whole raising the dead thing. But as long as she doesn't kill me... She won't. You'll be all right. Oh, yeah, yeah, you said that before, and then... And you're still alive. For now. 
Nothing will happen to you. We're all in this together, Grease. Funny to have this thing end where it started. Oh, yeah. I remember our first visit here. I've said it before. I really didn't think you were... A Jedi? Jedi or not, I just didn't think you were the guy. And now? Now? Jedi or not, you are. Look, I still don't quite get the whole Force stuff, but what I do know is that you are one tough kid. Thanks. So are you. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I do look young for my age. <laughs> Hurry up here, I'm hungry. Might try a new recipe for smoked kadu ribs. And there's something weird about this place. The energy is different here. Yeah, it's different than Dathomir. Yes. Dathomir is intricate. Its ancient power emanates from the shadows. Bogano feels more simplistic, and yet... I can't figure it out. Bogano is special. There's a reason the Zepho built their vault here. Where your holocron waits. Hidden. What are you getting at? This planet has remained nearly untouched for centuries. Were the lives you seek to protect really in danger before you intervened? The Jedi we train will help build a galaxy that respects and preserves special places like this one. And that is their choice or yours? We need each other to survive. Without the Jedi, I don't know if we can. We have a responsibility to protect them. So you've said. We're definitely not on Dathomir anymore. No, we are not. Is it how you imagined? The rest of the galaxy, I mean? It is so vast. I see now my life on Dothamir was... limited. I felt the same way about leaving Baraka. The world can feel small when you're trapped by the past. I think I will like my time aboard the Mantis. You Jedi should focus on doing rather than talking. Cap, about a second. You've been through a lot to get here, but the vault is still an unknown. Cordova put the holocron inside. That's what's important. I have to get it. Cordova built danger into this test to protect it. You're worried about me. I don't want to train all those younglings alone. I'll be fine, Seer. Plus, I've got BD with me. I know. Just be careful. This might be unlike anything you two have faced before. Thanks. We're ready. The both of us. Take care of each other. Are you ready for what comes next? Yes. And so are you. I've seen it. You've learned a lot from all this, Cal. And from you. That's kind of you to say, Cal, but I won't be in the vault with you. Yeah, you will. Just in a different way. I'm glad we found you, Cal. Good luck in there. And remember, think before you react. I suspect Cordova left behind a test not just anyone could solve. May the Force be with you. <laughs>